different amounts of blood are used in clinical practice. This protocol is used for isolation and purification of DNA from 9 milliliters of blood using the magnetic separation model of the Hemagen integrated robotic system. It consists of electromagnet and steering motor, both connected to metal rods. The metal rods covered with disposable tips enter into the samples and alternatively create a magnetic field or mix them. The different solutions move under the metal rods on the tracking system. The patient's blood is transferred from the initial tubes into tubes of 50 milliliters, numbered beforehand. The laboratory assistant carefully checks up if the tubes are numbered correctly. Two pairs of gloves as well as gown and mask are obligatory to prevent transmission of HIV, HPV, and other blood burn pathogens. Hemagen lysis buffer is added to destroy the cell membrane and nuclear membrane. Immediately protease is added to each tube to denature the DNA nucleases in the cytoplasm before interrupting the nuclear membrane. Protease destroys DNA binding proteins and releases the DNA. A rack with disposable trips is placed at position 1 of the tracking system as well racks with washing buffers on positions 3 to 6 and elution buffer on position 7. The rack with samples is placed on position 2. The robotic system is switched on by a computer controlling the system. Here we see the tips on position 1. The rods take up the tips. The tips protect the metal rods from contamination. Now the blood samples are moved under the rods. The metal rods connected to a steering motor simultaneously mix the samples for 20 minutes to facilitate lysis. After the lysate has been mixed, the process is interrupted. The sample rack is removed from the tracking system. A hemagen binding buffer is added to each sample. Then the magnetic iron beads carefully resuspended are added to bind the DNA. The positively charged ferry ions bind highly specifically to the negative charge of the DNA molecules. The rack with samples is positioned again immediately on the tracking system. Delay could result in low yields and purities. The metal rods mix the samples in which the beads bind to DNA molecules. When the electromagnet is switched on, these beads together with the bound DNA are attracted to the magnetized metal rods. Thus, these metal rods, one for every sample, transfer the complex of DNA and iron beads to the first washing buffer. When the electromagnet is switched off, the metal rods connected to a steering motor simultaneously mix the samples to wash the DNA from other cell components. The procedure is repeated with the next washing buffers. Using the Hemagen Elution Buffer 7, the DNA molecules are eluted from the magnetic beads, which thereafter are attracted to the magnetized rods and only isolated DNA remains in the tubes. 
The yields from 9 milliliters blood is about 1 milliliter of DNA. Isolated DNA is stored at temperature of minus 80 degrees Celsius for years. The Hemagen integrated robotic system is an excellent solution for isolation of DNA and RNA from various sample material, blood, tissue, bacteria, food, plants, etc.